Hey beauties, it's Brittany and I'm back with a different video today. So I'm going to quickly go through this and show you guys the try-on hauls as I'm speaking about them. So basically I went into Dresslink, I went through the site, I went to the best sellers and top sellers, the best reviewed kind of thing and went through them, did the research for you and now I'm giving you my review, telling you if they look like the photo, if they don't look like the photo, how they fit, if you should go size up, size down. And it's based on my sizing, which I am usually a small for tops and dresses and stuff like that. Pants, I'm usually a 2 to a 4, depending how they fit. So let's get into it. I will just pick pieces as I go and let you know what I thought about them. So the first piece here is a really, really cute nautical blue and white, very, very relaxed kind of t-shirt. It has very, very short sleeves. Um, it's a really nice material. Like, it doesn't feel super cheap. It's not super see-through or anything like that. But it does have like a little cinching in the back and for Asian sizing you're supposed to go up one size so if you're a small in shirts you're supposed to go up to a medium just because theirs are fit so much smaller but for this shirt in particular I do find I have a lot of extra room and it looks kind of unflattering it's a very relaxed shirt so it's not going to be too big of a deal if you like loose t-shirts go for the medium if you want something a little more snug fit so the back looks a little more cinched in go for a small I definitely think the length's long enough and there's so much extra room, you could definitely fit a small if you are a small. Otherwise though, totally worth the money and I will be wearing this even though it is a little bit bigger than I would like it to be. So this item wasn't actually reviewed. This is just one of the ones that the photo was so gorgeous and so pretty, I just had to have it if it was going to be similar. It is similar, but it's not identical. The photo you'll see beside my try-on shot, you'll notice that the detail in the flowers is a lot more intense. Very, very detailed and gorgeous, beautiful flowers. The dress itself that you receive is similar in color, but the flowers almost look like they're so blown up, like the pattern itself is so blown up that it's blurry. But I think from a distance, it'll still be cute. It wasn't as tight as I thought it was going to be. Like I thought in the photo of the model, it looks a lot more cinched in and very flattering. For the one when I tried it, I feel like I'm, I'm not gonna wear it out as an everyday thing. Maybe if I get a belt and cinch it, it'll look a lot nicer. But otherwise, I think I'm going to use this as a bathing suit cover-up. The material of it is, it's not quite chiffon, but it's something that I feel like if it, get, if it got wet, it's going to dry really, really fast. So I feel like this is definitely going to work as a bathing suit cover, so not going to waste. So this shirt, I was really, really looking forward to, and I'm so sad that it doesn't fit the way I thought it would. I think I need to go up one size, so I got a medium, and if you're going to purchase this and you are normally a small, I'd say go up a, a large, so two sizes up, just because it is kind of like there's no play in the chiffon material and the back is an open back. You'll notice in the photo of the model, it's an open, very flattering back, but it still kind of closes a bit in the back for her. When I put it on, it's a very boxy, kind of like my shoulders are almost too wide or my body's too wide, so it opens it all the way up and doesn't give that very sexy kind of peek through. So I'm gonna go up a large next time I purchase from them. I'm already looking into purchasing some more things that I wanted to try and review for you guys. If you really wanna see that next haul that I'm working on now, please give this video a thumbs up and I will do a try on haul for you guys. I love getting other people's opinions before I buy things, so I was hoping this would help you guys. Otherwise though, this shirt is really cute and I feel like with a black bra or a fancy bra on the back showing through it might even still work. If I have a smaller friend, I'm going to give this to her. So the next item, again, I would highly recommend going up two sizes. This is a medium and it's just a high neck and it's a crop top with long sleeves. The material is so worth the money. Like this is awesome material. It is kind of on the warmer side, but it's still very thin. It's not super see-through, like if you wear a black bra with this, you're not even going to notice, or a nude bra, you'll be fine, but if you were to wear white or something, and it stretches using this smaller size, I think you would kind of notice the white through it. Otherwise, though, this is totally worth the money, it is a very nice feel. I can still wear it now, but if I raise my arms above my head, it kind of rides up over my bra, so I would go with the large next time I order. Other than that, the sleeves are a little bit tight, but they will stretch a little bit. So like I said, if you're going to get this, go up with a large. I'm definitely purchasing more of these. They had a whole bunch of different colors, and I need the long sleeve. When it cools down in the summer, I like to wear long sleeve with my high-waisted, so I am definitely going to purchase more of these. The next item are these very floral kind of, I don't even know if you would call this a skirt. I think it's a skirt. It's like a fake skirt, but it's shorts. Uh, it's super like silky kind of material. I went with a medium. If you're going to go, like if you're normally a small in shorts, the medium should fit you well. Just if you have a bit of a butt, you might want to go up a size. I have a slight butt, I'm not going to say a huge butt, but the zipper is right up, like right up your butt crack basically. So if you have a really big butt, you might not get that zipper up. I just got it up and it fits comfortably once the zipper is actually done up. It gives you a little more room, the rest of the material stretches a bit. 
So I really like these and now I just need to find a top to wear with them. I had it with the black shirt I'm wearing on now, but this detail up here kind of takes away from the shorts. So I'm going to be looking into more things to wear with this. So the next shirt is just this black kind of crossed over fabric in the front you'll see in the model picture there. This fits really nice. It is a very nice, light, cool material. Like It's breathable. If you were to wear this out drinking or something like that, out to the bar or a music festival or something, it is going to keep you like nice and aired out. It is very flowy and relaxed, and it fits just about like the middle of the fold. Is that how you'd say? The front of this basically goes to my belly button. So if you're wearing high-waisted shorts, it's going to be a perfect length. If you like showing off your belly, I'm not a huge fan, but if you like showing off your belly with just regular pants, then go for it. It's a perfect length for that. Um, but it does slide around. Like the material of it is very kind of silky, so it is going to slide around if you're wearing a bra or something. So I highly suggest using sticky tape. In the photos I was using, I couldn't find my sticky tape, so I actually have like masking painter's tape folded up on top of my bra. So you may notice that, that's all that is. If you can tape it into place, it is going to be a really cute, sexy shirt. So I'm really excited about this one. So this dress here was one of my disappointments. In the photo, this beautiful dress looks almost like a sweater-like material, like a very nice material. The material it actually comes in is kind of like a fake spandex. Like, I feel like this, the Halloween costume I own in my closet right now is made from this. Like, it's just cheap. It's very see-through, like I can see through it holding it here. I don't know if you can tell on the camera. It, like I can see through it. I don't know if it, like if you wore a black bra, you probably wouldn't be able to tell the difference, but it's just not a material I was expecting it to be. But in the shot I'm gonna show you of me trying it on, it doesn't look horrible, but it does look cheap in person. That's the only thing that was the huge deal. Like I wouldn't purchase this again. I wouldn't recommend purchasing this. The photo just makes it look so nice, so pristine, and like such a nice material. Like the next dress I'm about to show you, it's that kind of material. It looks like it's going to be that material. The next dress I'm picking up, so this dress that I'm picking up here is my favorite of this purchase. It is that sweater material, the very light, like expensive feeling stuff. Like this is totally worth the money, this dress. So this dress is just a long sleeve um, striped black dress, and then in the front it has an asymmetrical kind of piece here that looks very, very flattering on the body. Um, I got a small in this. All the comments were saying, go for a small, go for a small, don't worry about going up the one size. It fits a little bigger. But if you have a butt, the material is going to ride up in the back. So if you have a butt like me, I would suggest going up the size like you're supposed to. I went with the small just to try it out and I kind of wish I went for the medium. It fits, but I won't wear it without shorts or something underneath because I feel like my butt may show. Like if I'm drinking, I'm not gonna think about that the whole time. So I wish I went for a medium and I may get a medium in the other color. I think there was a few colors of this, like stripe wise. So I make it the other color and in a medium so it fits a little nicer. But other than that, this dress is my favorite purchase from this. Totally worth like the $7 I paid for it. And my second favorite purchase from this one are these shorts. These things look tiny, right? Like these look like these could fit 12 year olds. In the photo you'll notice they fit me pretty well actually. So in the comments they were saying the shorts come super small. But don't worry, they stretch. If you have a butt and you normally wear um, a small, I'd suggest going to the large because these ones fit me, the medium stretch and fit me, but I'm kind of at the limit of stretching. So if I was ever to gain weight, or if I really wanted to move around and dance or something, I feel like there's a chance they would rip. So I kind of wish I went up one size so I had that little extra bit of playroom, but other than that, these shorts are my new favorite shorts. They're high-waisted, they have the cute little gold zipper detailing, and they are comfortable. Oh, and they have two little pockets. Awkwardly long pockets in the back, but two little pockets. So everything from Dresslink, I pretty much love. Some, like I said, I wish that one dress had the better flower detailing, but other than that, I am really happy with all the purchases. I think with all the items I, I have just shown you and the shipping, it only came to $65. So I'm going to leave Dresslink down below for you guys. So like I said, I have started another purchase from Dresslink. If you want to see that haul coming up, please let me know in the comments. I've also put in a purchase for ColourPop Cosmetics, which should be here within the next couple days. If you guys want to see that, please let me know in the comments, and if you haven't already, please subscribe, become one of the beauties in this lovely family, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!